welcome back to another epic EV video. Today we've got something super exciting in store for you because we're diving headfirst into Toyota's incredible new breakthrough. In this video, we're taking you behind the scenes to uncover why Toyota's going all in on these next level solid state batteries. Why are they making this thrilling pivot? What's driving this monumental decision? Well, we've got all the details you need to know. With the new management, we're seeing Toyota way more interested in the future of electric, unlike Akio Toyota's time as CEO. And guess what? Toyota is shifting its focus to improving solid-state battery tech, which means we might see the end of hydrogen-powered cars. As a company that first pioneered revolutionary hybrid technology, Toyota has a rich history of innovation in the auto industry. Despite these achievements, hydrogen cars have faced numerous challenges, the primary obstacle being high upfront cost. The production of hydrogen fuel cells is still a costly process, resulting in cars being priced higher. Additionally, the limited availability of hydrogen fueling stations has created range anxiety among potential buyers, restricting the convenience and accessibility of these vehicles. Nevertheless, Toyota remains undeterred. Alongside their dedication to hydrogen fuel cell technology, they are effectively investing in solid-state batteries, believing that this technology could be the new saviour for electric vehicles. Their pursuit of innovation continues, as they strive to overcome challenges faced by hydrogen cars and shape a cleaner and more sustainable future for transportation. While Toyota was initially hesitant to enter the EV market due to concerns about range anxiety, infrastructure and cost, the company has since reversed its position. They have launched several electric vehicles such as the Prius Prime, RAV4 Prime and the BZ4X. Moreover, Toyota is now making significant investments in battery technology, specifically focused on solid-state batteries to replace the current lithium-ion ones. Lithium-ion batteries have registered a significant number of disadvantages. They have a limited lifespan. They typically only last for about five to eight years, after which they need to be replaced. This can be expensive and it also creates waste. Lithium-ion batteries are flammable. If they are damaged, they can catch fire or explode. This is obviously a safety hazard, and it can lead to environmental damage. The mining of lithium is a dirty process. It can pollute water supplies and contribute to climate change. These drawbacks, plus its scarcity, propelled major automotive and scientists towards solid-state batteries as a replacement. Solid-state batteries are a type of battery that uses a solid electrolyte instead of a liquid electrolyte. This makes them safer, more energy-dense and faster charging than lithium-ion batteries. Solid-state batteries also have the potential to be more affordable than hydrogen fuel cells, which are another type of zero-emissions technology. Differences between solid-state batteries, traditional lithium-ion batteries, and hydrogen fuel cells. Solid-state batteries use a solid electrolyte, while traditional lithium-ion batteries use a liquid electrolyte. This makes solid-state batteries safer, as they are less likely to catch fire or explode. Solid-state batteries have a higher energy density than traditional lithium-ion batteries. This means that they can store more energy in a smaller space, which gives electric vehicles a longer range. Solid-state batteries can be charged faster than traditional lithium-ion batteries. This is, this is because the solid electrolyte does not have to be transported across the battery, which speeds up the charging process. High cost. Toyota has developed new materials and manufacturing processes that have helped to reduce the cost of solid state batteries. For example, Toyota has developed a new electrolyte material called sulfide based electrolyte, which is less expensive than traditional lithium ion electrolytes. Toyota has also developed new methods for recycling solid state batteries, which could help to further reduce their cost. In a solid-state battery, the electrolyte is a solid material that allows ions to move between the electrodes. The traditional electrolyte used in lithium-ion batteries is a liquid electrolyte made of lithium salt dissolved in an organic solvent. This liquid electrolyte is flammable, which is one of the safety concerns with lithium-ion batteries. The sulfide-based electrolyte is less flammable than the traditional liquid electrolyte, which makes it a safer option for solid-state batteries. Sulfide-based electrolytes are also less expensive to produce than traditional liquid electrolytes, which could help reduce the cost of solid-state batteries. Lower energy density, Toyota has developed new electrolytes and electro materials that have helped to increase the energy density of solid state batteries. For example, Toyota has developed a new electro material called lithium metal, which has a higher energy density than the current graphite electro material. Toyota has also developed new methods for packaging solid state batteries, which could help to further increase their energy density. 
flammability. Notably, Toyota has developed a new electrolyte material called a ceramic electrolyte, which is less flammable than the traditional liquid electrolyte. Toyota has also developed new safety features for solid-state batteries such as temperature sensors and pressure relief valves. Faster charging. Toyota has developed a new solid state battery that can be charged to 80% in just 10 minutes. This faster charging time could make solid state batteries a more attractive option for electric vehicles. Longer lifespan. Traditional lithium ion batteries typically have a lifespan of 5 to 8 years. This means that after 5 to 8 years, the battery will no longer be able to hold the charge as well as it did when it was new. This can lead to range anxiety, as drivers may not be able to rely on their EV to get them as far as they need to go. Solid state batteries, on the other hand, have the potential to last for 10 years or more. This is because solid-state batteries are not as susceptible to degradation as lithium-ion batteries. The solid electrolyte in solid-state batteries is less likely to break down over time, which means that the battery will be able to hold the charge for longer. Competition. Solid state batteries offer a number of advantages over hydrogen batteries, such as being safer, more energy dense and faster charging. This could lead to increased competition between the two technologies and could ultimately benefit consumers by driving down prices. Replacement. Solid state batteries could eventually replace hydrogen batteries as the primary power source for electric vehicles. This is because solid state batteries have a number of advantages over hydrogen batteries as mentioned above. Collaboration. Some companies are working on ways to combine solid-state batteries with hydrogen fuel cells. This could create a new type of battery that combines the best features of both technologies. For example, Toyota is working on a solid-state battery that uses hydrogen as an electrolyte. This type of battery has the potential to offer a number of advantages over traditional lithium-ion batteries, including higher energy density, meaning more energy can be stored in a smaller space, faster charging times, better thermal stability, making them less likely to catch fire or even explode, and longer lifespan. The main challenge to developing hydrogen-based solid-state batteries is finding material that can conduct hydrogen ions efficiently whilst also being stable and non-corrosive. Toyota is using a material called sulfur as the electrolyte in its prototype batteries. Sulfur is a good conductor of hydrogen ions and is also relatively inexpensive. However, it can be corrosive, so Toyota is working to find ways to stabilize it. Other automakers that are working on solid-state batteries include Panasonic. Panasonic is a leading manufacturer of lithium-ion batteries and they are also working on developing solid-state batteries. Panasonic has partnered with Toyota to develop solid-state batteries for electric vehicles. BMW. BMW is a German automaker that is also working on developing solid-state batteries. BMW has partnered with QuantumScape for the same. And Hyundai. Hyundai is a South Korean automaker that has partnered with Samsung SDI that is also working on developing solid-state batteries. So what do you think? Can this solid-state battery help Toyota catch up with the EV competition and bid farewell to hydrogen technology? Share your thoughts and don't forget to subscribe.